Hey everyone, just going to run you through this week's programming and some of my lifts. First things first, I want to wish my wife a happy birthday. Today is her birthday, so happy birthday, babe. This set right here is my top set of squats, which is 365 for 6 on Monday. And um, I worked up in five total sets of six reps, and that's been going for the last two weeks and next week I will start in five ascending sets of four reps and the weight's going to continue to increase. Um, so next week it'll go up to 375 um, as a top set. So by the time I get to these top sets, which you'll see in this video, I've, I'm already pretty fatigued, especially on my deadlift day, which was just uh, wrought with technical failures. So you'll see that horrendous deadlift set. So after my my back squats on Monday, I do my back off work, which is 10 sets of three reps with 185 on the front squat. And front squatting twice a week is definitely helping out. Here is Tuesday's work. I worked up on slingshot to 325 for six. Feeling pretty good with the slingshot work. This was definitely like an RPE nine and maybe nine and a half. Um, but I'm feeling pretty, pretty good about it. 325 for 6 with a slingshot. Um, I might be a Brett Max or something. I'm not really sure. But bench is definitely coming along strong. So I didn't show you the back off work for Tuesday. I accidentally deleted that video. Wednesday, I uh, had some technical failures with my camera. So like in Moron, I decided it would be a good idea to just do my top set again so I could see my bar speed with 405 on the 2-inch deficit. Well, as you can see, I'm pretty fatigued because this is my sixth set of six reps. And this last rep right here was absolutely an RPE 10. It gets above my knees and my lockout right there just sucks. I hyperextend my back. Terrible deadlifting right there. But for 36 total reps, I suppose I feel all right with it. The deadlift is coming along nicely. Um, the back off work on Wednesday was back squats again. This is 275 for 10 sets of three. All the back off work is... 10 sets of three reps and next week it's going to go to 10 sets of two reps and the weight's going to increase on the back off work also. So the wider stance squatting is feeling really good and then Thursday I get to my military press day again five ascending sets of six this is 165 for six um, a struggle on all of these these top sets this whole week I definitely feel like I picked my my choices of weights on the top sets of six pretty well because they're all ending at about an RPE 9-ish, somewhere in that range. So the back off work on Thursday was a close grip bench, pausing 185 for 10 sets of three. Get to Friday, front squats. I'm getting much better at these, still not as good as I, as I would like. I mean, the fact that I'm front squatting less than what I'm benching is kind of a sad state of affairs to be in, but hey, I'm trying to resolve that. Get to my top set of six with 275 right here. Um, my best lift closest to this, I've done 285, I think, for for five. So this is all right. The rep quality is pretty good. Get to this last one. My elbows drop a little bit more than I'd like, but hey, I was pretty pretty tired. Do my back off work. Back to deadlifts again. This is all, again on that two inch deficit, which is going to remain for the next two weeks. Also, I'm pulling 275 for 10 sets of three. Um, pretty slow off the floor with these, and that might just be with the, being tired from the front squats, but my lockout was definitely snappy and I like that. So here's today's bench work. I worked up to a top set of 285 for six and um, I knew this was going to be a struggle but not too bad and I got to that last rep right there, decided to pause it just a little bit. Um, that's like a little baby pause so might not count, probably won't count a competition but hey, it is what it is. Do the back off work some 10 sets of three of 115 on the overhead press. Everything's coming together pretty well on this training cycle. Next week I'll be moving the weights up and dropping the reps per set down, still doing five ascending sets. Um, I think in about six to seven weeks I'll be testing some new one rep maxes. Um, but we'll just have to wait and see how the schedule goes out here. So thanks for watching.